So today I'm back at IHP uh, for Free Silicon Conference and earlier I met Rackable, who has this interesting stand here. Rackable, tell us about what you do at IHP. Uh, well, I'm Rakibul Hassan from Circle Design Department. Um, actually, I'm responsible for designing high-frequency circuitry. So we uh, do everything on chip. So we uh, design antennas, we design active circuits and make the chip for different applications, for example, microscopy, then we have the radar for uh, like uh, automotive industry application mm -hmm. and we have also circuit for data communication and many other fields even we go we go to space okay. we have some circuits already on some uh, satellite and some other space station you know we use it in this way great yeah. and um, your table caught my eye because you've got some really good looking circuit boards here so tell us a little bit about what's going on yeah there. so we have some uh, so these are some like uh, previously designed circuits and published and with my former colleagues that did it at 60 gigahertz, 120 gigahertz. And these are the latest design at 256 gigahertz. I mostly my contribution here. Mm -hmm. So I develop it for uh, radar application. Radar. Uh, radar radar mm -hmm. application, yes. And uh, for example, the first one is a scalable architecture. So we can, it, uh, we can increase the number of channel mm -hmm. which uh, enhance the angular resolution of the radar and also we enhance the bandwidth mm -hmm. and it's also one possibility to get, get more bandwidth when we have we deal with very high frequency you know right so more bandwidth means like high range resolution mm -hmm. and more channel means like we have a more angular resolution we can okay. detect very tiny objects which are closely placed in this way and the next one is the multi-mode radar we can call it so multi-mode is it is applicable for multiple applications simultaneously with the same board with only one BCO mm -hmm. and we have like 256 gigahertz transceiver here and we have 120 gigahertz transceiver, two, two channel mm -hmm. and again 60 gigahertz. For 60 and 120 we use onboard antennas which is... That's what uh, these are yeah, structures. These are the board. antennas, yes, it's the array antennas. We have, uh, we can get high gain with it but on chip like mm. 240 we have on chip antennas so and there's your name rackable hassan yeah it's, it's yes. a, it's a, so <laughs> in the third one we make it even like very dense one so mm -hmm. it's a single chip we place two chips side by side so we can scale it continuously by keeping lambda by two distance you know okay. we can make it very large massive mimo okay and it's a very i can say costly because big it's big chip area and we have one chip antennas like 40x 4rx antenna single chip so here is two chips okay two trx chip yeah. So this is for communication stuff, or is this radar? All for radar. All for radar. radar. Yes. Wow. Yeah. Okay. And is um, is are you mostly doing the chip design or the board layout or the whole thing? I do everything actually. You know, from uh, from designing the chip, mm -hmm. designing antennas, integrate together, making the chip. So we measure partly, you know, antennas separately, yeah. chip separately. Then we make the board to have the full demo to yeah. show to you or in some conference, you know, yeah. so it's like a full process of steps we touch, you know, so we just use our expertise to even, yeah, sometimes like we, because the fabrication we do outside, mm. the, the board fabrication, yeah. the chip is here inside, you know, yeah. the clean room, so, so, but the design is from us. Nice. Great. Well, thanks very much for your time today, yeah, Rackable. Thank you. Welcome really, for uh, coming in. Enjoyed yeah. finding out a bit about this uh, high speed radar stuff. So, if you've got any questions or comments, then just make sure to leave them down in the description below. Thanks.